The year is finally on a roll, and March saw a solid block of releases that finally made me have to pick and choose carefully. As always, the judgement call on these is personal, so let us know what had you excited in the month of March. This is AppSpy's Top 3 iOS Games for March 2013. While some have complained about the controls, I only found they added an endearing quality to the nameless robot you control. He's just a little bit clumsy thanks to his haphazard construction. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. That said, for a game with such a limited control scheme, it manages to throw a whole lot of interesting puzzles at the player, making it well worth checking out if you haven't already done so on the PC. It's not often I find myself in a position of actually empathising with a main character in an iOS title. Often this is not the fault of the developer, there's only so much you can do with an arcade game. So I'm willing to be lenient. However, Fetch's incredibly simple yet heartwarming storyline kept me ploughing through its incredibly detailed world. If you have a child or you don't mind games that err on the easy side of things, you're sure to enjoy Fetch. Maybe it's unfair to award two adapted titles, but it's hard to say no to a game like Night Sky, especially when it feels so perfectly suited to iOS devices. With little more than tilting back and forth as well as the occasional tap, you'll need to solve a series of fine-tuned puzzles centred around the momentum of the orb you're controlling. This can range from flipping gravity to controlling vehicles. It's surprising how much variety there is, and well worth checking out. Of course, we can't cater to everyone's tastes, so you might also find yourself loving titles like Block Fortress, and its incredibly deep build em up tower defense by way of Minecraft gameplay. Super Stick Man Golf 2 keeps the series running strong and even manages to throw in a few new surprises. Ridiculous Fishing had a rough start thanks to Ninja Fishing stealing some of its thunder, but this release proves it's still the king of the hill. And lastly, Dungeon Hearts won't be to everyone's tastes, but a recent update has managed to balance and stabilize the game, giving this wonderfully unique genre hybrid a second chance at success. And that's all for the month of March. Like what you see? Jump on the subscribe bandwagon to get the latest videos as soon as they go live. Want to help AppSpy grow? Jump on Twitter and Facebook and start pimping us out. In either case, have a great weekend. This has been Andrew with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.